G'day team, back on a Wednesday today and it's just how life aligned that I was here at the right time for you guys. So today I want to talk to you guys about a big thing that I've been travelling in the last, you know, seven, ten days type thing and it's called emotional intelligence. So with the loss of a pet on the weekend and I had to take my son for that journey and I think there's nothing harder as a parent to take that journey with kids as well and try and explain it and hold your shit together enough to function. Now, it's not to say that I didn't, it, you know, at that moment of uh, decision. Yes, I had a cry. It's a sad thing. Yes, I had a cry with my son um, and shared the news with other family members and, and we all had a bit of a cry and a sad and I made a memorial video that I put on my um, pages. I haven't shared it in this group, but it's all over all my TikToks and YouTubes. I don't actually, I don't think it's on YouTube. It will be all on other socials. So um, yeah, so memorial video there for this pet. And part of that is as a parent and been able to express emotion openly with my kids and understand the journey of that and allow them to journey that. But also part of that emotional intelligence is other people coming in, for example, um, not to say that I'm not open to another relationship with a female, but um, the boundaries that I have set personally from the understanding of the emotional journey I went through with my previous marriage to go, all right, so now I understand where I align and the boundaries I have. So that if someone wants to come into my life, they have to one, understand that I have kids and stuff like that. And then, um, you know, there are, are boundaries with how much emotional baggage, for lack of a better term, I might want to allow into my life. So, you know, that requires a boundary. And that's also the same for any females that want to come into my life. They can have their boundaries and I have to fit within their boundaries as well as, as part of our emotional intelligence. And if you're not sure of what I mean by emotional intelligence, maybe send us a message and then I can share with you some of the things um, on, on how I've journeyed through this and what I mean by um, yeah, understanding your emotional intelligence. There's lots of videos and, and lessons and stuff that I did to learn this skill. And it's a big skill as part of creating a more whole personality and a, a person so that I am um, aligned with myself rather than trying to have a, a mask on or, you know, because there's lots of things, for example, losing the pet, you can try and play tough, but it hurts. Um, so and that's that i can hear the two-way going in the background so i've got to get back to work so that's the long and the short of today's wednesday wisdom is emotional intelligence and understanding um allowing emotions to flow sometimes it's like a river uh, you know so sorrow love hate all those sort of emotions can flow but how to journey with them and have the boundaries within yourself to be a whole person and not not have a mask or be hiding something so there you go that's wednesday wisdom Peace out, have a good one.